HCF of 30, 36 and 38. To find the HCF, for that we should do the prime factorization of each number separately. What I mean is 30, 36, 38. This is your step 1. Next. In this number, last digit 0, so take 5. When do we get 30 in 5 table? 5, 6, 30. Now 6 is 2, 3, 6. 3 is a prime number, so 3, 1, 3. Now the other number, last digit 6, A1, so take 2. First number 3, a number close to 3 in 2 table is 2, 1, 2. 3 minus 2, 1, 1 carried forward 16. When do we get 16 in 2 table? 2, 8, 16. Now 18 is 2, 9, 18. 9 is 3, 3 is 9. 3 is a prime number, so 3, 1, 3. Now the other number, last digit 8, A1, so take 2. First number 3, a number close to 3 in 2 table is 2, 1, 2. 3 minus 2, 1, 1 carried forward 18. When do we get 18 in 2 table? 2, 9, 18. Now 19 is a prime number, so 19, 1, 19. Therefore, our HCF is, HCF is the product of the numbers which should be present in these three places. That is here and here and also here. So now let us find the numbers which should be present here, here and also here. Starting with the number 5. Do we have 5 here? No. So no need for us to check in the other place. Next number 2. Do we have 2 here? Yes. So go to the next place. Do we have 2 here? Yes. So cut 2 right here. Next number 3. Do we have 3 here? Yes. Go to the next place. Do we have 3 here? No. 3 is not present in all the 3 places. So we cannot write here. No more numbers have been left out. So we got only one number 2 present in all the 3 places. So 2 itself is our HCF.